Hey guys, this is Rosa Kelly. Welcome back to a new project on the fall series. So let's take a look. There is a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get by It doesn't make it easy so hi guys, welcome to the final day of the craft series. This has been so much fun to share with you. Quick and easy ideas. Again, these are inspired on craft fairs. So all of these items that you've seen are super quick and easy to make. And one of my favorite things to shop for are always notebooks. I am a notebook lover, especially when I see a beautiful cover notebook. I don't even know what I'll use it for, but I know I need to have it. So this time I decided to actually create my own notebooks using some of my favorite scrapbook papers and it is a quick and simple project but you'll see how much these notebooks are going to put you in the mood to document and to create different things and so i am using for these notebooks this paper collection by Bo bunny again i love these beautiful little fairies and i am using notebooks that i purchased at uh, target for like 50 or 60 cents and because they just finished all their back to school and they had a lot of these back to school notebooks for sale and so I took the opportunity to grab a few and I decorated these ones for fall but of course I'm gonna be probably making the same for Christmas as well and uh, who doesn't like a beautiful decorated notebook so I went ahead and created a pocket here to just make it a little bit more interesting but again a very simple notebook goes a long way so I went ahead and decorated just the inside covers and over here too and so of course you can add a little bit more and you can add a little bit more to the pages as well i even thought of like coffee dyeing the pages like or like dipping this on tea or something but i don't know how the lines will hold i just don't want this to become a really big mess but you can definitely give it a try and if you wanted something more grungy or more um kind of like looking more like a journal you can definitely do that as well we have been using our notebooks to actually go over some homework and to create some notes but ultimately what i want to do with this is kind of create a collage book and add some like things that we collect during the fall and mainly like leaves if we want to take a walk i want to create a bucket list and also i want to glue in here recipes that i always collect from magazines but i want to glue them down so maybe i'll use one for recipes for the fall and one for all of our fall activities that we always want to do and so these are basically going to be my brain dump and just kind of have everything on one place i do have my planner but on my planner i try to be a little bit more aesthetically pleasing and just do the things that i you know kind of half oriented for the day but i'm actually really excited and inspired to use them because they're just so pretty to look at to keep on my desk and i hope you guys like the walkthrough as i mentioned at the beginning of the series this series is a giveaway so all you have to do to participate is to be subscribed on to my channel to make sure to leave a comment and leave a like for each one of the videos on the series and the winner is going to receive a happy mail package from me where i'm going to include some of the projects on the series along with some other crafty goodies as well so again make sure that you are subscribed leave a comment leave a like and yeah that's all you have to do to participate on the giveaway this is going to be open to us um, subscribers for my international subscribers i'm going to do a hundred dollar gift card to my website where you can purchase any video class or any digital collections any pdf tutorials um, that is available there so I hope that you guys enjoyed the projects that I uh, shared with you on this series. This was so much fun to make. Please go check out my digital magazine. I put a lot of uh, work in there, a lot of effort and a lot of love uh, for you guys. So I want to thank you so, so much for watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye bye. It's all gone.